2018 Fiat 500, reinvigorated with a standard turbo. Making it cheaper didn't goose sales, but maybe more power will do the trick. Overview, say goodbye to boring with this adorable scoop of Italian gelato, the Fiat 500 is here to brighten up your garage. A 135 horsepower 1.4 liter turbo 4 powers both coupe and ragtop convertible models. A 6 speed automatic is optional, but those who prefer to shift for themselves can stay with a standard 5 speed manual. A spunky looking body kit and 16 inch wheels are standard, inside, a 5.0 inch infotainment touchscreen adorns the dash, while a round digital screen lights up the gauge display. In trying to make its diminutive Fiat 500 appeal to Americans, Fiat Chrysler has been throwing things at the wall to see what sticks. After dramatically dropping the price last year, Fiat is now adding horsepower to the entire 2018 500 lineup making a turbocharged 1.4-liter .4 four-cylinder standard equipment on every non-Abarth 500. The Abarth and the California and Oregon-only electric 500D continue unchanged. This version of the multi-air engine, previously available in the mid-range Fiat 500 turbo offered from 2013 to 2016, brings a welcome boost from the discontinued naturally aspirated 1.4 liters 101 horsepower to a more robust 135 ponies and 150 pounds to foot of torque. Our test of a 2013 500 turbo revealed a 0 to 60 mile per hour time of 8.1 seconds, a significant 1.7 ticks ahead of a 2017 500C with the Wheezy, non-boosted unit. A 5-speed manual transmission is standard and a 6-speed automatic is optional, regardless of whether you choose the pop or lounge trim level or the hatchback or 500c cabriolet body style.